Once in the lap of luxury, there lived a dog named Puccini. When his master bit the dust, he lost his upper crust. Moved by his dismay, Puccini ran away. He wound up in the pound, where he was soon found. Now he's got a new family. They're not rich, but they're happy. He's a highbrow who's living the low life, Puccini. <laughs> I'm feeling in the mood for a back massage. Would you be so kind? This is the life. Pheasant under glass, my favorite. You wouldn't thump your leg, Puccini. It's so uncivilized. Truly sorry, Mum, but the chef outdid himself this time. I can escape this hideous nightmare and get back to my pheasant on the glass. <laughs> my compliments to the chef. That was a splendid repast. Don't you agree, Puccini? Splendid indeed, I suppose. Puccini. It's time for our after-dinner drive. Driver, pull over here. I wish to do some gift shopping. Oh, and driver, could you take Puccini around the block? Puccini needs his exercise. Ta-ta, Puccini. Strange lot. They appear to be experiencing some sort of affection. Very peculiar, yet charming. Go ahead, Puccini. Open it. <laughs> A key? A key for your very own diamond-encrusted sports car. <laughs> Ooh, fancy that. If only I could drive. No, Puccini! Don't be vulgar. We are not common ruffians. You are quite right. Please forgive my gross indiscretion. Look what else I bought for you, Puccini. This gift is extra special. What is it? What is it? Aha! There you are, little Poochie. Huh? This will keep you from having all those rotten nightmares. I need to find 
find another hiding place and sleep my way back to the safety of my dreams. place where Billy won't find me. A perfect spot. But how shall I manage it? Serenity at last. <sighs> Happy birthday, Puccini! How thoughtful of you! Oh my god! Billy's dead! <laughs> Silly puppy! You are having nightmares! <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. 